Notice how the sounds roll one on another. The distant sounds. The short ones. The long ones. Okay. Um, we'll turn the lights up here. I, I must admit that was just a teensy bit dramatic. Um, but I am trying to prove a point here, you guys. And the point is we're using way too much plastic that or paper that is really not biodegradable. Specifically, I may be talking about the coffee industry today. The coffee industry is using millions of tons of plastic that isn't sustainable. Not to call out any specific companies, <clears throat> no, for real, I'm not calling out any specific companies today. It's just that I found some solutions for you guys that you can use for your packaging, whether it be a coffee brand or another type of brand that is biodegradable pouches and plastic. Check this out. We've got this issue of plastic often used in packaging and set. Not all plastic is bad, not all paper is bad, but some is much better than others. So the other day I was on Kickstarter and I actually came across this company called Alpaca, Alpaca Coffee. And they just finished, as of June of 2020, they just actually raised, they more than doubled their ask. Um, but this company is on a mission to have a completely plastic-free coffee company. So I know a lot of these coffee companies out there are, are really trying to practice sustainability and use better, more sustainable package, and a lot of you are as well. But a lot of them really are honestly missing the mark. And unlike others, this alpaca coffee company is, is definitely not missing the mark when it comes to sustainability. So check out their, their packaging right here, you guys. So as you can see here, it's made of craft paper. It's got a compostable valve. We have a wood pulp lining and a compostable zipper. So what is this material that Alpaca Coffee and other companies are using to pull this off? So the, the material is called Nature Flex, you guys, right there, Nature Flex. Um, and you can work with a design packaging agency like We've got some pretty cool experience. Um, but you can work with a company like ours to actually design this for you and then get these materials um, streamlined and done for your manufacturing if it's not the whole package, partial package and whatnot. But the great thing about this is when you have a product or a food or something like coffee or you need a lock in freshness, you need to actually have taste the flavor or something lock in, keep the UV rays out, keep that moisture locked in. This is a great solution and it's not plastic. So the bag composition is made up of a brown, unbleached craft bag. Uh, it, this makes up about 44% of the package itself. The lining is made from a wood pulp that is certified biodegradable according to the European standards. That inside line is ma making up about 14% of the bag. Also, the zipper is made from bioplastic. Um, bioplastic is often used from like sugar cane and other materials, which is biodegradable and fits into the European standards that they are shooting for. And the, the valve that is on the front of this coffee bag here is also made from bioplastic, which is a sustainable, biodegradable material. Okay guys, I'm gonna nerd out for just one second here. So what is bioplastic? So t bioplastics are typically made from wheat, corn, or potatoes, and they're made from natural resources to make plastic. Now, this NatureFlex stuff that I refer to is actually made from cellulose. And so cellulose is made up from wood pulp, uh, which is one of the most abundant resources that we have today. So this NatureFlex stuff is highly sustainable, highly biodegradable and compostable. By the way, do you guys remember that video that I posted a while back on mushroom packaging or mycelium packaging and Ikea is trying to move towards this type of packaging for better sustainability? Check that one out. Guys, gals, everybody, thanks for joining me here on this episode over at the Mint Mob where we, we show you guys the freshest packaging ideas. Now, if you like this video, go ahead and like it. We really appreciate that. Give us a subscribe if you're into really cool packaging and, um, and share it if you really care. So we'll see you guys on the next one.